Hi guys, I wanted to talk to you about, um, I've been doing some propagation because it's official. I will be selling plant cuttings and full plants, so feel free to contact me um, uh, through messaging if you like and or I will provide an email address in the description. So I wanted to talk to you about my Monstera Deliciosa, which if you watch my plant video some videos ago, this baby has truly stretched out. I am so fortunate, I'm so proud, I'm so excited, I feel so privileged to have gotten one of these when I wanted one finally. and. Um, I'm going to be propagating from this one. So this is the Mama Queen of the Monsteras. And what I'm looking at is basically, so I could cut in here if I wanted to, but the reason why I'm getting, well, I want, I want to propagate anyways, but you see this leaf here? I definitely don't want to just cut it off for no reason. And I told you in the last video that I accidentally got it too close to the bulb so it burned and I eventually just took the scab off and eventually this plant is gonna this part at least this leaf will go and instead of having that happen as you can see a new baby has come in so there's plenty of energy there present there's no point in just you know not working with her and completely cutting her off so you don't always have to do that depending on you know what condition your leaf is in look at all that green you know it still has energy still can photosynthesize still give to the plant so instead of me, I, I know I keep repeating myself, but instead of me cutting off in here where you see one coming in, kind of reminds me of a node, but there's a root here and what I did with the other one, I kind of gently tugged on it because if I can actually get some of that root off, that would even be better. Um, there's nothing wrong with the roots. The, the plant is thriving. If I can just gently pull in there, I might get some lifting, but you know, you do that anyways when you're repotting. Uh, the last one came out a little bit easy. I'm actually, pull, I'm actually pulling out of the dirt. I haven't had to cut anything yet, which is what I prefer. I just wanted to say, if any of you have ever experienced plant woes, I am. Um, I'm so happy I was able to propagate. I actually took more cuttings than I planned on, but I'm a little sad because the plant is definitely not bald, but just I miss those leaves. So. <sighs> I'm not the only one that goes through that, I know. But, um, I will show you some pictures of what my Monstera, my Mama Monstera looks like now. And I still celebrate her because she's still here. And she's giving life and making babies. So, here's to more babies and a stronger and healthier Monstera. Talk to you soon. Bye.